Welcome to Thinking Rich with Amy Robles. This is the podcast made for you, the smart, ambitious woman. Thinking Rich is the show to help you think bigger, create your business you love, and keep your family first. We know when you enrich a woman's life, you help her entire circle of influence. Now here's your host, Amy Robles. Hey, thanks for joining us today. I'm delighted to have you here. Welcome to your Monday Maxim with Amy. This is your mental vitamin B. Each Monday, I share a little motivation and insight to start the week. You've got a lot of people depending on you. There's big work for you to do. So here's a maxim for you, the smart, ambitious woman, to help you shine. Today's quote comes from Dr. Leo Buscalia, and I've seen his work on greeting cards on those walls where they have all these really cool thoughts and all these different things. But I had no idea who this guy was. And so I really started digging in and doing some research about what is this guy all about? And I found the video. At first, I went right with everything. You Google it first, then it leads you to one place, then it leads you to another place. And pretty soon you're deep in the rabbit hole and you wonder uh, and you just figure out and study about this guy to find and make sure that this person is worthy of our time. And the more I found out, the more I realized, man, I have got to find more of him. His quote for today is, love yourself, accept yourself, forgive yourself and be good to yourself. Because without you, the rest of us are without a source of many wonderful things. And as I was thinking about going through my business, the different things, how I'm helping women, how I'm really talking about business techniques and different strategies and marketing and how do you write better and how do you keep it crisp and how do you do the customer service, I realized all of what I'm teaching, all of what I'm sharing with women in all of these different facets of where they are in their business is all about love. Learning to love who you are, learning to appreciate the gifts that you have that no one else can give you. And so in this research, I was digging in and I found this one little YouTube video and it was nine minutes. And I thought, yeah, I I definitely need to see. This is just the start of a talk. And it ended up that this nine minute video led to the next part of the video to the next part. And I watched over an hour of him talking about what is love. What does it mean? How are we living our lives? And I've left a link in the show notes so you can follow along. And he says, the hardest battle you are ever going to fight is to be just you. That's it. That's it. In my coaching practice, the women that are really working to build their business and do something unusual, the hardest part is understanding that it's unusual because nobody knows as much about that topic as they do. And it's okay to stand up and be an expert in a field that nobody else is talking about. I don't care if we're talking about ballroom dance or foot zoning or how to create the ultimate dinner party. These are all different topics I've been working with. And it's just amazing to see just to fight and to be you and to love and appreciate who you are at this time. Then Dr. Leo Buscalia goes on to say, I'm really convinced that if you were to define love, the only word that is big enough to engulf all it would be is life. Love is life in all of its aspects. And if you miss love, you miss life. Please don't. I have never been moved to tears from a YouTube video, but that is what I share. This is the message of who I am and what I want every one of us to understand is it is love. It is understanding and it is dealing with the difficulties and the frustrations. And that is what makes us stand out as smart, ambitious women. 
we not only keep things organized, we make sure people are where they are when they need to be, and that all the details are taken care of. It is this overwhelming, beautiful love that we share. And some of us share it with lots of hugs and tenderness and kissing and tons of affection everywhere. And some of us show it, make sure everything is organized and taken care of us. And some of it is shown with the words that we use to express. And that's all part of our love language and the way that we work together. Some of it, us show it through the acts of service or through the gifts that we give one another. And that is so powerful. It doesn't matter how we express it, but being able to show that love to one another, to be able to be a light and bring others in is how we shine. Trust yourself. This is an incredible process and this crazy roller coaster ride of life that if we don't have love, we're just missing it. And love doesn't mean it's going to be all perfect and roses and glitter and unicorns. But being able to cry together and to be there and to witness and to support one another, there is nothing greater than that. Make a choice to make a difference. You're a smart, ambitious woman. It's time to shine. Have a great week, and I'll talk to you soon. Thanks for listening today. Remember, you can enrich your life and your bottom line. It starts with you. See you next time on Think Enriched with Amy Robles.